Hello, Bill Molino here with Bill's History World with none other than Goober the Traveling Bear. <laughs> well, we're in Gloucester, Virginia, and we stopped at this roadside to Gwynn's Island. Two miles east is Toonsbury, home of the Todd family, or Toddsbury, built in 1722. Farther east in Matthews County are the old homes of Green Plains, Auburn, and Mitholane. Some miles beyond them is Gwynn's Island, where General Andrew Lewis drove the last royal governor, Lord Dunmore, from Virginia soil, July of 1776. So, when you see a historic sign like this, Goober says, if you can find a safe place to park, pull over and learn some local history. Thank you, everyone. Stay safe, be kind, be courteous, and we'll visit Gwynn's Island in another video. Hello, Bill Molino here for Bill's History World with none other than Goober, the Traveling Bear. And we're at the Edge Hill House in Gloucester, Virginia. The Edge Hill House, 1750, is a colonial building in Gloucester Courthouse. John Field raised the two-story frame structure onto a brick first floor in 1833. During its early history, it was used for mercantile, carriage and wagon building, and blacksmithing, dressmaking, and as a dwelling. The Gloucester Woman, Women's Club, established in 1913, purchased the property as their headquarters in 1920. Wow. The club continues to preserve this landmark for the benefit of its members and the community. The house is placed on Virginia's Landmarks Register in 17, 1973 and the National Register of Historic Places. All right. Um, well, Goober says, let's walk around the building a little bit. So today's video will be uh, just a video of the grounds. Um, at some point, I'll see if I can have a tour and if they'd be interested in a video of their wonderful building here they have restored. The Edge Hill House at the corner of 17 and 14 in Gloucester, Virginia. So here we have the well. And we'll just walk up here. So, two-story, very nice. We'll pause here. Well, as we walk up, we have the benches here, and here's our Gloucester Women's Club, Virginia Historic Landmark. Very nice, very well taken care of gardens and pathways. So, we got brick and then clapboard. Walk around the other side. It's always fun to explore, and there are no uh, signs saying no trespassing or anything, so I'm okay with that. Very interesting peak up there. Very nice. So I'm going to have to. Uh, investigate more and find out when uh, they are open for tours and how all that works. Go on their website if they have one. And here's the back of the building. All right. We'll pause our camera here. All right, as we walk back along the front, we have a very nice porch up top. And like many, I would think this would be a cool little garden. Probably was 
Could have been their herb garden. And we'll get a view of our building on this side. Just wonderful. And I got to say, they're really doing a beyond, above and beyond keeping this building looking pristine. Well, that's about it for now. I think we'll move on to um, other exciting places in Gloucester, Virginia. Stay safe, be kind, be courteous, and I hope to do a follow-up video of this cool historic home in Gloucester.